What is happening, Ranger Nation? Welcome back to another Poe Rangers Battle for the Grid. Versus! Yeah! Today's fan request is the White Ranger versus Scorpina. Oh, yeah! Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and hit that bell to be notified when more Power Rangers arrives. And special shout-outs to all our members, including Woo-hoo! our ultimates. You awesome. guys want to hop aboard the membership train? All you have to do is click right here, select the tier that works best for you. Yay! So I'm going to be Scorpina that's a Void of Sun, and, uh... <laughs> yeah. Um, you're going to be Pasty Scorpina. You're going to be Pasty Scorpina. She's been stuck up on the moon for a while. Evil Mike and evil... Honestly, it depends on what side of the moon you would be on, though. Yeah, and I suppose... Yeah, that's a more accurate version of her. That's, that's like, quarantine uh, Scorpina. Mm-hmm. Well, I'll be Jen, I guess, and... Although I want to keep calling her uh, Lammy now, after, like, all that Super Sentai stuff, which was a lot of fun. I, don't en- I enjoyed that I don't previous know. episode. I don't know who I should be. Who should I be? Tommy again? Other Tommy? Oh, you already are Tommy. I'm a, I'm a Tommy. Darn it! Well, I mean, there's there's Tommy, 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 Jason, nope. and... Okay. Okay, that's all right. I'll be this group. Yeah, Tommy, 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 and Jason. Yeah. And everybody else. <laughs> and hopefully another Jason skin <laughs> one of these days. Ah, oh, command center, you need to be destroyed. Come on. No. All right, let's go here. More destruction. So anyway, you're watching Power Rangers versus on K-Wings Let's Plays in the comment section below. Tell us the you want to see battle Scorpion. next time. And I'm your worst nightmare. Oh, yeah. It's <laughs> morphin' time. What up, White it's Ranger? It's morphin' time. Uh... uh I like how he shakes his head around like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's, let's this, get... this is one of our most requested uh, character bouts next Ooh. to um, Dragon Shield Jason. Yeah. I'm feeling too stressed out to even move. I'm kind of like, yeah. I'm excited for this. Oof. I remember when the, the White Ranger skin was such a big deal, too. Like, people were so excited about yeah. it. And then they were like, wait, how in the world is... What's he going to do about summoning Dragon Zord? And then they were like, nope, Tiger Zord. <laughs> Yeah. Oop. Oop. Oh, Tommy. I accidentally switched out. Sadness. Oh, that's fine. I should have said a Tommy line. You're going down, Scorpina. Tommy didn't really fight Scorpina a lot. Um, that's because Scorpina didn't really fight a Barai or or uh, what was the name of um Genki's brother? I don't remember, but the the Green Ranger and Sentai. Usually fought Goldar quite a bit, and you know the Red Ranger oh, wow. and stuff like that. But I don't really remember him battling Scorpina very much. Lammy, Lammy, <laughs> yeah, I liked our conversation last video about yeah, it was fun. Sentai. Oh, today, oh yeah, today we fight. Oh, I see. You are Mike. I am Mike. Mike and Ike. I like Mike. <laughs> Ow. Mike is... Whoa, whoa, no, whoa, Mike! Whoa, whoa. Mike does not appreciate that. Stop that. Right now. Well, I don't know what you're fighting for, though, Mike. I know what I'm fighting for. What What are you fighting for, though? Uh, like, you haven't told me. Like, you keep saying you know, but, like... Could you, like, give us a clue over here, Mike? Like, we're drowning. Mm. Throw us a... <laughs> throw, us, throw us a bone. I don't know. Throw us a bone. We're drowning. What is... Throw us a freaking bone here. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it was, was like, a, what is the line? If I'm drowning, why would I need a bone? I, Throw me a... I think it, it's a Dr. Evil line. Oh. oh. Well, like, Casey Jones says it, too. Like, throw me a clue. Oh, he says, throw me a clue I'm drowning? What is it line? What is that phrase? Does anyone know what it is? Oh. You're going down. Wolf dude. Going down, wolf dude. Zero in on my coordinates. Uh, oh. Tiger Zord! Oh, I stopped it because I kicked you in the face. Are you kidding me? Yep, I stopped your Zord. Honestly, though, Tommy's suit looks really dope. Yeah, yeah. I mean, your su- suit looks okay, but I mean, come on. I don't really like the gold version of your suit, like the red version, but... The evilized version, but it's okay. Oh, no. I'm gonna die. Yes, you are. No! Oh. no! 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 Oh yeah! My Megazord is ready. You're going down! Ah! I got stepped on. I forgot what his name was. RJ. RJ. How can you forget RJ? Because I forget things a lot. 
Uh, we do go about <laughs> two months between each uh, yeah. Power Ranger series. Sometimes. All right, so uh, White Ranger is won one time. The name's Scorpina, and I'm your worst nightmare. Scorpina team, <laughs> not. Morphin time. All right, Tommy. All right, Tommy. Let's go. Whoops. Ah, I don't think Scorpina is a good match for Tommy. Because you have to remember, the White Ranger powers are supposed to be pretty OP because Zordon was the one who created them. Yeah. Although they've just confirmed again in the comic books that uh, Jason was supposed to be the White Ranger. Oh, according to Yep, according to original stuff from the show. And uh, yeah. some Power Ranger stuff. Well, I mean... Like... Written Power Rangers. Yeah, style. I mean, like, I really feel like something weird happened on the set where there was just a lot of tension. And no, he left. Oh, right, right, right. He left right, right. and they redubbed it. Right, yeah, he couldn't really be the White Ranger if he wasn't there. Jason That's wasn't around point. for the ADR anymore, so they, yeah. they redubbed everything. That's why he's totally cool when Zordon says, and Tommy will be the new leader. And Jason's like, oh, right. It's like, what? Yeah, because everyone in their seats was screaming like, "What?" <laughs> yeah. Also, everyone watching the White White Ranger stuff when Tommy was around as the White Ranger, um, they didn't actually film new scenes to show him as the leader. Jason was always saying it was morphing time. He was always oh, getting wow. like the close-up shots still. Oh. Wow. It wasn't until like um, ASJ actually left the show completely and they brought in Rocky with the Ninja Encounter and other yeah. things. That you started to see that it was more the White Ranger, the Blue Ranger, and the Pink Ranger, yeah. with like archive footage for Red, uh, you know, and Red and Black and Blue, yellow. Or we yellow, yeah, 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 yeah. Yep. Blue was still there. Although they would still have their suit actors, um, you know, the the suit stunt people doing stuff. Yeah, I honestly feel like. Billy is the ranger I wouldn't want to be because he had to stay on the show and they kept taking away his lines. But that seems to be I get the short end of the stick all the time in real life where mm -hmm. I end up being the Billy of my own life. Where it's like, I'll just stay one more year. It will be better. But it never is. So I feel like if I could go back in time, I'd be like, Billy. Just leave the show. It's never gonna get better. Like they're gonna have you working on a show that has little younglings. Like you need to get out of here. Even if you're living on the street, it will be better than being in the show, being disgraced in this way. Like just leave. Leave the show. Like I don't know. Yeah. I would want him to leave the show. I feel bad. But you know, when you need a paycheck, you need a paycheck, honestly. So what are you gonna do? I don't know. I think it would have been a really interesting... I, I don't think Power Rangers would have survived if um, David Yost um, had stayed on. Like, if he left with Austin, Twee, and Walter, and they just had um, Kimberly and Tommy, yeah. I don't think the show would have worked. No. I think that they kind of... Honestly, I feel like they kind of like used him to keep going. Mm -hmm. I think it's... Wait, no, that's two for you, because Pink Ranger's on your team. Uh-oh. Oh. Uh oh. Two for me. And I'm your worst it's like. It's like. They probably lured him to stay on the show. And then once they did, they were like, well, you're in contract now. And then they gave him no lines and just used No, them. he had. I mean, his season three was pretty big, but oh, okay. it really feels like the breakaway star of uh, the new cast was uh, Johnny Umbosh. Oh, wow. Okay. Like Johnny, Johnny became like the Tommy character. He became pretty popular. It's life lessons about Power Rangers. You can just tell that life is unfair. Mm. The people who put a lot of work, dedication, didn't always get recognized. People that stood up for other people, they were the ones getting fired. Yep. You know, the people that were kind of like talking behind other people's back and outing them and wanting to be better than them, they got more lines. It's just like life is just not fair. It just shows it just shows how unfair life is in general. It it never works out. Like when you're younger you think, Oh, this will just work out. Like I'll just keep being a good person and work hard and life will just work out. And like you guys should think like that, it's good. But when it doesn't work like that, it's you have to realize that life does not work always work like that. Then you have to figure out how to survive after that. Yeah. Uh, Ooh, that's painful. Come on, Scorpino, you can win once. It's but yeah, the, oh, the White that, Rangers. It's really us. hard because, like, even you and I, like, mm. we've had contracts with certain companies and stuff, and you just cannot leave. So, like, that would be so frustrating to be on the show and 
have all this stuff happening and you can't really leave. Well, according to David, like, he actually at one point did think about, like, leaving the show uh, with yeah. the with the other characters, but, like, uh, he, he was convinced to stay by Amy Jo, who was, oh, wow. like, his best friend. And, uh, you know, everybody thought that things were just going to kind of go back to how it was, like, the other characters were going to come back. Like, how But they, you know, Saban wasn't waiting. Saban was just like, nope, just yeet everybody and you know, he fired uh, those three, and then he got rid of um, a bunch of stunt people. He yeah. got rid of behind the scenes. Everybody involved with the quote-unquote walk-off or whatever, yeah. he just got rid of everybody. So. Yeah, it's, I mean, it's really it's really tough to know, like, what, what to, like, it's really tough because everybody needs a job. It's so, you know, life is stressful. You always need money to live. Mm-hmm. It's honestly, it's hard to blame. Like, everyone always has a reason to blame everybody, but in reality, everybody has to do what they have to do to, to get a job and pay their bills. I mean, you can't just be like, oh, you know, I'm going to do this because it's the right thing to do. Now, now I'm homeless and I hope someone will take me in. It's like, well... <laughs> yeah, ASJ really lived in his car. That. Huh? ASJ lived in his car. Oh, wow. After Power Rangers, well, he had no plan. it just shows, like, how high of a sense of morality that he had like he didn't even care it was like this is right i'm doing this and i'm like he sounds like me when i was 20 years old honestly it's like that exactly sounds like my personality because it's like i'm on the board he believed in a higher good you know yep i'm on the board good job being on the board. i'm how many, excited how many things you, do you have you, two to two it's two to one. Oh wow that's my first for sure good job wolfie wolfie yeah Wolfie. Scorpina team on the board. Scorpina is on the board. Uh. She's actually. I mean, that would have made it cooler. The way she looks, I would have rather watched a Power Rangers movie with her in it. Scorpina. Than the than the lady they had. I think they waited. I wouldn't have had Rita be the villain of the first movie. I think they should have built that up. It should have been like yeah. Goldar or Scorpina. Yeah. I agree like build it up to Rita but honestly she didn't even look like Rita in that she was the Green Ranger turned back yeah, she didn't look anything like Rita that I know as Rita with no. a dress and stuff like this like she didn't look like Rita so like I would have done like that looks like somebody who could have translated into a modern film a lot better like Scorpina or like you could have had Goldar yeah like have some of the, the, the minor minions come at you first why would they send in the big minor minions? Why would they send in the big guns right minor away minions. to a bunch of like, you know, teenagers with attitude that are just starting up? It, why would you send? Why would you bring in the cavalry the first thing? It doesn't make any sense. It just doesn't make any sense from a supervillain standpoint. Well, I mean, it looks like Rita survived at the end of the movie. Like, I mean, the Megazord just kind of like shot her yeah. into space I think which I, would bring the moon base into the equation and the green ranger and, yeah I didn't really you know. like the uh, well now that I can say it I didn't really like the uh, I didn't really like the storyline of her together with Zordon and everything I thought that yeah. was I thought that was terrible like I I just I would never picture them together like Rita is this person that lives on the moon and she's part of some kind of like ancient race and technology and stuff that has nothing to do with humans. She's like a, a Saiyan. She's like Vegeta or something, coming around, destroying planets, taking over the world, and now Earth is just another dot on her you know, thing. Like, she just doesn't like anybody. It doesn't make any sense that they make it this thing where it's personal with Zordon. That doesn't make any sense. Zordon. Well, she, be she betrayed the team and she wiped everybody out um, because... It wasn't just her Green Ranger powers that made her powerful. She had, like, the scepter that they don't really explain. Um, but her, you know, her scepter from the TV show apparently had, like, superpowers or something and was able to kill all the Rangers. Uh-oh. And Amber's the winner. Sorry. Well, I guess we'll have to hear about that another time. Uh, I mean, they don't really... Sh it's, like, the first five minutes of the movie that it's shown that, you know... Uh, yeah she was able to just wipe everybody out but anyway people that is going to do it for today's power rangers versus thanks so much for yeah. watching stay tuned later today for more uh hyrule warriors awesome. i believe we're doing some marvel stuff with the um kate bishop dlc so yeah awesome. and uh we'll see you with a live stream at eight o'clock on something else until then 
God bless and happy gaming. Thanks so much for watching. Hit up the playlist for more Power Rangers versus. Bye bye. See you.